Last year when I became principal of Andrew Jackson, we noticed a true need for some sort of membership for our young men and women, especially in the upper grades as they were getting ready to transition into high school. And a connection was made through one of my parents with an organization called the Rising Sons. A lady came in and told us about the dire need that her school was in as far as, you know, the young males having any role models. The connection and the relationship to the students began and a group uh, led by Alex and some of his colleagues of, of well-educated, bright young men and women came to Andrew Jackson on a weekly basis to actually uh, mentor, build relationships, uh, maintain important conversations for the students and it's been a partnership uh, based in service that they are giving back to, to my kids and in turn hopefully my kids will be giving back to the community and to younger children. We really, you know, jumped out on a whim. Um, last year we really came out, we saw what the school needed, we saw that there lacked murals, there was no art on the wall, so one of the major things was Alex, he really wanted to put together a mural project. And that was one of the things that we really wanted to do. We wanted the school to realize that the impact was here and it was a way to show that um, we really cared about the school. The mission of Rising Sun is to empower unserved youth through personal and professional development as they get back to the community through service. The reason why I think my organization is important is because um, we're, we're young, I'm, I'm 24 years old, and if you look at the media and you look at the vision of you know, young black males, you see nothing but violence and getting in jail or robbery and stuff like that. I figured this is a chance for really, really you know, to show that you don't need to take on into the street. And when young people see someone who's around their age, a little bit older, trying to do something positive, they look forward to, to doing that. Really just trying to take those negative stereotypes of you know, young black men or just young men in general and really you know, showing a positive aspect is one of the things I think you know, why we really are important and having these people to follow along with us as we're doing it. One of the biggest um, issues for us was uh, my African American population of young men trying to really re-engage them in school and to re-engage my families in involvement. And the boys were kind of looking for something and it just was like a serendipity that Rising Suns came along at this point in time. I participate in Rising Suns because I feel that um, Alex and more like big brothers to me and I, I really like this program. Our program is very different. One of the main things I would say is our um, relation with the children, you know, being relatable to the children, um, letting them know that we're not much different from them and, you know, we're always one mistake away from being a statistic. Um, a lot of our kids, when they're in these programs and when they interact with some of these people who run programs they're in, they don't get that type of connection. So we really try to break those barriers down and build those relationships with the kids to let them know they're not alone in this fight and they're not the first ones to go through it as well. I would recommend Rise and for the kids because it's like a place where we can have fun and just chill and talk about stuff and it's like a second family. One of the major things Rise of Sons wants to do is really take on from an educational standpoint, building that foundation of I can do better, I want to do better, and then going on from the professional development, whereas I can get a job, how to maintain a job and work for a career so I don't have to always work for someone else for the rest of my life. And then, you know, community development, community building, family togetherness is building that foundation within your own home and with amongst your peers, you know, that you can live in a tranquil uh, community and not have to be subjected to the violence and negativity that we see today in the urban community. I think um, to be a hero, you really have to care about the people you serve. You know, um, it's really not self-indulgent for ourselves. We don't do this for the acclaim. We really do it because we see there's a void there and you know, we have to fill it. But I can definitely honestly say I do this with all of my heart and I really don't look for anything much in return. I have to say the Rising Suns are my heroes. Uh, they bring to the table a ton of positive energy and our whole thing here at Jackson is our pause, positive attitudes, winning success. Um, Rising Suns came in uh, with, their, with their motto for us, which was a brand new Drew. And that's what it is. Uh, it changed a mindset, it changed a, a look of a building, it changed a feeling of a community. So they are truly my heroes.